to where it was. Five all, first set, 30 all. Sprem showing off her back end there, but just missing it. Karolenko is one of the players you watch play. Every stroke is so pretty. She does everything very, very well on the court. Good serve, good volleys, good groundies, but she lacks that one major weapon that really prevents her from. Oh, Boy, did she ever need that. Another break point. Uh, terrific round strokes. Two. Ace for Sprem, six all. Uh, Booming serve from Sprem, one all. Clinch. Back to back. Mademoiselle Sprem. Well, she's not going to win an exchange of backhands. Just pulverize that backhand. <laughs> but you just touched on it. Pivotal point. Late in the first set. She gets another try. Oh, Karolenko! A little bit of indecision on Sprem's part went right back at her. But that's incredible ball control there by Kirilenko. What heartbreak to lose those last two points by Sprem. Dead. Oh, just long. Maria Kirilenko takes the first set in a tiebreak. Now there's that backhand again. One all, second set. Pick that next step. Oh! And there's a fine yeah. line as a top player when you see draws of a... Would be planted in your head. Fair? Absolutely. I, f I felt like there was a chance on clay that I would could lose to a player that I wouldn't lose to on a hard court on an indoor court or on a grass court so for me it gave me much more angst coming here and I still managed to do pretty well on the clay I knew I was never going to be a uh, French Open champion or a contender year in and year out but I tried to do respectable when I mm. came here but it came at a great cost <laughs> do you feel any of that as you were Flying here, did any of those feelings come <laughs> back to you? I was thinking the opposite. This is just the greatest <laughs> trip to Paris I could imagine. You seem very relaxed. I gotta tell you. <laughs> Break point. Well, go figure. Very few break chances in the first set. And here we are three games in. All breaks in the second set. It's 2 1. It's of shot players, I should say, not quickness. It's a 
very intimate stadium. The court has a very small feel. Going to build a little separation in this second set. We're midweek by Wednesday. Strong first serve from Kirilenko. One of the dangers, it's important for these ladies to get their first serve percentages up. All done. Now Karolenko was on the defense of that point. Return for Karolenko and a break point. And Karolenko benefits from the double fault from Sprem. For our Lacoste player profile, Maria Karolenko, very close with Maria Sharapova. She dates ATP player Igor Andreev. She enjoys reading music and did appear in the 2009 SI Swimsuit Edition. Most importantly. The last one? Yeah. Oh, I thought reading and music. <laughs> that was the lead story. You were telling me how much you like to look at the <laughs> swimsuit edition. I'm a subscriber. It, it comes in the mail. <laughs> Conditions were and get a feel for what it was going to be like at Rolling Garros. Well, for me, I almost always played the week before. A great serve there by Spremmerts. Big kick on that second serve. Oh. First serve percentage now under 45%. Deep ball from Sprem. Well done, Kirilenko. Really the best two points of the set have happened in the last two points, and there it's... Now you touched on it, the fact is Sprem is a shot maker. <laughs> Hard fought win for Maria Kirilenko. She knocks out Carolina Sprem. 7-6, 6-4. Kirilenko on to the second round here at the French Open. Well, a good win for Kirilenko. Great job of pulling through that first set. Really was down in that tie break.